Thailand is in the grip of a youthful uprising. Inspired by Hong Kong, students are taking on a military-backed government and a once untouchable monarchy. What we're seeing here is an epic battle between two competing visions for Thailand. These youngsters are determined that their demands for reform of everything, including the monarchy, are both heard and acted on, and they're up against an establishment that is determined to keep Thailand stable, conservative, and with the monarchy and military at the very top. Palm is a 21-year-old student and now a familiar face at these protests. Hers is a rowdy generation. Informed and mobilized through social media, taking the Hunger Games salute as their own symbol of defiance. <laughs> They want the king's power to be accountable and they want the freedom to speak out without the threat of reprisals. ประเทศเรามีการทําและเป็นอำนาจใหญ่มากสถาบันพระมหากษัตริย์ควรจะมีการถูกพูดถึงหรือถูกตรวจสอบมาตั้งนานแล้วเป็นอำนาจใหญ่มากสถาบันพระมห
a former politician who gets a personal word of thanks from the monarch for his pro-palace activities. He thinks using the toughest laws against the protesters is justified. But that's just not true because in Britain you can say pretty much what you want about the Queen and you won't go to prison. It's very different from the situation here in Thailand. คือเอาง่ายๆเราเรามองจริงๆหลักการสิทธิ์ที่เขาขอถามอ่ะถามว่าเขาสมควรมั้ยที่จะใช้คําหยาบขนาดนี้แบบต่อเนื่องแม้แ